Hello and welcome back to Siege of Centauri, where we are now move on to Mission 10. So many enemy aircraft, they blot out the sun. Persia attacking? Are we the Spartans? I'm King Leonidas. I'm I'm not going to sacrifice myself. I'm going to run for the hills. Don't allow any buildings to be destroyed. Upgrade metal refinery or fission reactor. Destroy all enemy waves. So yeah. They just unlocked the flight cannon, so now it's like, hey, deal with these sparrows. Which it's looking like that's gonna be... So we got the mediums, swarms, fast movers, mediums, swarms, fast movers, cruisers with large shield. Let us begin! I think it's... Yeah, after this, it's gonna be like, pick and choose what do I want on my missions. At Galaholt, we captured some of the enemy's technology. One of their units didn't fully complete its self-destruct sequence after we disabled it. Husk has ordered the wreckage to be placed into quarantine until he can contact Darius. That's a sensible precaution. Which means I'll have to be careful when I examine it myself. Darius is going to let no one but Milton examine it. We need human eyes on it. While Husk and the rest of the command staff are tending to the battle at Lacuna, I'll slip into the lab. And see what secrets I can steal. Mwah, I don't know. Okay, so... A swarm there? Okay, they're going to move in from there. It looks like single entry point. Comes in from here. Go to here. They might try to attack that building there. Then they move on. So yeah, they have a single path. But multiple buildings they can get at. Wait, are they free? Oh my god. I thought these things weren't supposed to, you know, attack until I've placed towers. Okay, we got the them being taken down. More sparrows. Build another flat cannon. This many bombers will overwhelm our Icarus Sams. The Falcon Anti-Air has a shorter range, but its area of effect will splash large groups of enemies. Icarus Falcon out air. Next, light swarm frigates are coming in. Bang, bang. Okay, I need to upgrade. Them there. Get another smoke drones down there to try to hold them off. Ooh, 
to the upgrade that. Where's the metal refinery? Upgrade that and improve our improve our metal production. There we go. Getting rich. Get the metal. Hold them there. The scavenger. So yeah, these are cheaper because you need more of them to actually deal with them too. and I haven't actually built stuff to take out the eradicator. Get another drone, cause I like these drones. These drones are great. You get a couple of them working together, man. They can just cut through these, you know, light swarms pretty good. Expensive to go do since uh, even with the uh, upgrade to reduce the cost, they uh, still over 100 metal. Don't have the cannon, not for Novas. I got drones cleaning them up over there. Get another Nova. Make sure those shields are dead. Flat cannons, go! Area effect increase would be nice for that too. Oh my god, they are just throwing everything on here. Shit. Come on, bring him down! I don't want to lose the outpost. Oh, there we go. I was like, I don't want to lose, I want all the objectives. Achievement unlock the swarm. Gravity channel. Always love these in tower defense for slowing the movement rate of enemies. How much does it slow it by though? 1238, I'll take it. Not like I said, at this point I don't know how high in score that actually makes me. Could only be 1300 people that have done these this far missions for all I know. I uh, still need to get that. Uh. Alright, mission 11. Colony seems unassailable, so they brought thousands of units for their attack. Okay, that. Shit. Achieve victory without Chrono Shift. Achieve victory without Milton. Destroy all enemy waves. Heavy Swarm fr Frigate. Jeez. Got some medium cruisers, but a lot of heavy swarm. Increase the gravity pull. And let's launch. We won again at Lacuna. 
But while we were busy here, an explosion was detected at Epicurus. As far as we know, that's the first colony that's been completely destroyed. What happened? The enemies had purposefully been leaving these colonies intact. Did something change? Or did the colonists do this themselves? For now, we've diverted to Ascent. As much as I'm interested in finding out what happened at Epicurus, there are no lives left to be saved there. Here, there are. Damn. Yeah, I wonder if they're gonna explain what's going on at all. Alright, surround your ways. Land without chrono shift, so. They all are going to come from here and make a slow circle. Looks like. Fighters spawn from here, move over to here. Heavy swarm frigates, so... Okay. Let's see how am I gonna do this? Thousands of ships are massing near our colony. They have outfitted their reaper swarms with armor. We are classifying it as a scarab. It looks like they intend to throw them against our defenses until they break through. This will not be easy. Gotta upgrade that. Jesus, that's a lot. Reinforce it. To that, all right, I need drones. These gravity gravity ship that we have today, that gravity channels are nice. For the gravity channel, it'll slow down all ground and air units in range, leaving them vulnerable for our defenses. Let's also put that there. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. All right, they're dead. Oh, well, mostly dead. We're working on it. Upgrade 
red light borders. Okay, don't, I'm not gonna have enough for that, so. Get the light mortars upgraded. Get those upgraded too a little bit. On, kill them so they don't heal each other. I don't know if they can or not. All right, upgrade that. Okay, so so far we're actually doing pretty good. that there to repair that. Yeah, right now they're just stop lagged here, so so far this isn't as hard as I thought it was gonna be. Total campaigns go wee. But now there's a whole shitload of them moving in. Oh my god, that is beautiful. That is effing glorious. They're just tearing them apart, yes. I am happy as hell. Let's rush a wave. Upgrade my particle lasers real quick, hopefully. to slow things down. Let's try overloading a corrosion mortar to, mortar to just try to get as many of those uh, corroded. Oh, this is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Would be a lot harder if I was rushing everything, that's that's for certain. since they are separate. Yeah, these gravity channels, they are nice. Here come swarm fighters, and hopefully they'll hold off. Oh, since I upgraded the last few of those, you know. They're just swarming in. Yeah, they are not making it through there. So this is also just a normal difficulty too. On hard, they'd have a lot more health, so I'd probably have to try to do more attrition-based uh, tower placement instead of like how I have it where now it's just like, yeah, this this is gonna annihilate them all. Yes, and the ion disruptor is now unlocked. But yeah, it was like no melt and no crow, so it's like, oh my god, this mission is gonna be hard. 1366. Well, at least I know that more than 1,300 people made it this far now.
But, uh, that, that went pretty good. I rushed two waves, yes. My massive rush, rough, rough score, rough score. Yeah, the mortars did, did work there. Yeah, I'm not super impressed with the corrosive mortars. They just take too long to do the damage with what, how I'm fighting right now. Then on to mission 13, Thurlos, Eight-Legged Fiends. Scanning for hostiles. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Cruiser, shield of the cruiser. Powered in native life forms are of Centauri. Aggressive and provoked. Okay, so we have shitloads of those coming at us. Have everything that I wanted to bring. All right, let's do it. We found a new mystery at Ascent. One of the colonists we rescued was pregnant. Darius Robotics rendered all colonists infertile when the initial wave of ships was sent. Population growth was supposed to be delayed until the colonies were stable and secure. Which means either the colonists found some way around that or something else is going on. We've moved on to Thurlos. More lives to save, though the fights get tougher. The enemy's strength has been increasing noticeably. I don't like the direction of that trend. Me neither. Okay, I see. Finish mission within four minutes. Rush, 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 rush. The, uh, see, because... What would be the purpose of here? Because there's nothing there. That, hopefully they go direction. Probably not. Probably gonna go up. Wait, wait, wait. I just realized I'm doing this, approaching this mission wrong right off. Mystery at ascent. That's what I did. I did the same thing on that one mission where the open thing where I tried to defend here and it got me into a lot of trouble, so... Let's actually try this at the start in terms of initially try to stop them here, then build out here if I need to. The spiders are looking very angry. Maybe we should have left them alone. Ah, I messed it up. Medium cruisers are next. Rush the wave. The colony is under attack. Uh. The colony is taking heavy damage. Okay. I, mean, I don't see the dan- Where's the- Oh, there it is. Okay, I think I fucked this up. I screwed it up. Yeah, I was looking there, I was like, oh, it's not taking that much damage. Okay, I screwed that we found up. found a new mystery at Ascent. I do actually have a... Different idea, I need to go back to... Back to here. Because I just realized it's one... Arc Protector... That upgrade. Bring shotgun turret, turret for them. 
Might as well keep that. Oh, okay. All right, let's see how this this works. And back it up with arc projector. Those spiders are looking very angry. Maybe we should have left them alone. The shotgun thing allows those turrets to hit multiple. The colony is under attack. All right, it's taking damage. Me. I don't have the energy for it. Okay, I'm still failing at this. It's doing so good before. Disable enemy shields. I don't have that. Once they're dropped, our other turrets can quickly destroy the hull. Oh, crap, you went the wrong way. I don't have the Ion Disruptor, because I did not bring the damn thing. Right, 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 but... Kill it, kill it, kill it. Holy crap, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get the on the clock with this. I did not bring the right setup. Cause I, like, I should have probably pricked the Ion Disruptor over the Nova. Nova dude, Nova Tower. Yeah, I can't frickin'. Now we're so Milton in there real quick. Those little n initial swarm guys are frickin' nasty. Can I repair that? I'm just curious, I'm curious on that. Trying to do Milton. Heh! <laughs> I did get the on the clock, even though I wasn't really trying for it. Yay! EMP orbiter, nice. Okay, well, that's the third mission. 2300 thing. I'll take it. Screwed up the mission. I did not set up my towers like I probably should have to deal with those spiders. Still wondering what the proper way of dealing with those are, because they use the arc tires, but the arc tires didn't seem like it hit enough of them to really do it. I'm wondering if the light mortars would have actually been better for dealing with them. I'm not sure. Either way, that's going to be the end of this episode. I'd like to thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, then please leave a like, and we'll 
see you in another video down the road. Bye for now.